the youtubers welcome to the channel the loquacious one how is everyone doing i hope everyone is fine thank you for tuning in and i would like to request to you if you're a new or first time viewer please if you enjoy the contents of my video and my platform would you please tap that subscribe button as well as that notification bell and everyone thumbs up if you enjoyed it and if you're on social media and you know someone else who enjoy these types of videos and contents Please share on social media. And to all my ride or dyers, thank you so much for your kind words, comments, and support. I love you truly and dearly. Thank you. And again, everybody, happy Valentine's Day. It is February 2019. Okay, spring is coming up. Thank God. Um, I am so tired of cold and snow. But that notwithstanding, uh, it's time to start thinking about redecorating because we're going to be doing spring cleaning. So you want to grab some things that are affordable because you want to change out your different vignettes and displays and what have you. And you want to do them affordably. If you're not a big thrifter like me because I don't go to thrift stores or what have you. And I'm not going to spend all that money on things I figure that were too simplistic to justify the cost. So, <clears throat> excuse me. I went into Dollar Tree and found some decorative items. So I'm going to show them to you because you know their items go really, really fast. And one suggestion is do not decorate with one. One doesn't have much impact on it. Um, you need, excuse my jacket in the background, you need at least multiples that are in odd numbers such as three, five, seven, like that. Okay, but if you don't have multiples, make sure you combine it with a third element or another element so it doesn't just look so matchy-matchy. Alright, I went in the store and I purchased another one of these because even though these are candle holders and they also have, uh, have them with the gold metallic finish at the lower half and the silver. I purchased those also and showed them to you in a previous video. But I want to group this with uh, some items on the coffee table. I will be using it for a candle holder. I will be putting a faux plant in that. So that is, I thought, really endearing. Because even though this is a mini candy candle holder, Z Gallery has a lot of vases. And of course, they are taller, but they have this type of pattern. And I purchased some similar to that from Burlington and Ross. They carry them also. So look for the trends at Ross and Burlington also. Okay, early on, and early on at haul, I had hauled these, uh, they're candle warmers. Or you could use them for oils. Or wax cubes. I purchased them in green because they didn't have the white. But I found the white at another store. So I purchased them because I thought they were so cute and elongated. And of course they have that Celtic design. And I thought these were really, really just cute. So I got those. And look at this awesome find. Everybody knows the marble finish is on trend. And um, I was going to DIY some candle jars to marbleize them. But oh thank God I walked in. Yesterday and found these. They are so cute. These are by Star Candles. And the scent is called Cozy. Excuse, ooh, losing focus. Cozy Sweater. It's three ounces. Um, the scent is nice, but I don't know about the throw because I haven't lit it yet. But those are a great find. Those will go fast, I'm sure. Now, this is not a new item. They have this for the previous years. But I'm always getting them because I break them or DIY them or use them and various events but these are so stunning they have three sizes I'm just showing you two uh, but if you just had to I would put this with a vase or something else you know if you don't have a multiple three use something else something coordinates through color or through the same type of uh, like a glass candle holder that's wider you know yeah make it work okay we're here to not be monotonous and to repeat what we see but to be inspired by what we see and these whole little tea light candles and I think they are just cute okay so I'm always getting these next are these clear bottles they are awesome I, I DIY one with rhinestones it's going to be in a display uh, that I have that will go in a shelving unit but how awesome are these they had them in other colors including frosted glass ones I didn't need them. I think these are more uh, diverse, so that's why I got them. But they do have them in colors. Sorry, I can't remember the colors. And they did have them in different shapes. So they have a ton of, bot of bottles in different shapes that if you want to DIY them, they are awesome for that purpose. Last but not least, these cracked glass uh, 
candle holders. I've had this before. I use them as makeup holders. You could use them, uh, makeup brush holders, I should say. You can, of course, use them for your candles. You can use them for floral displays or what have you. But they're awesome. I'm going to do a DIY. And again, you see this multiple threes. How cute is this? You can display this on mirror or silver. It will look absolutely gorgeous. Okay, that's it. That's all. From a little haul, just to show you some of the things that are available that you can, you know, vamp up your house this coming spring. Change out your pillows, your lamps, vase, uh, you know, just change it up. Switch it around in different rooms. If there's a picture frame you don't like or vase or lamp or lampshade, by all means, if you could DIY wire, you can spray paint it. Okay, add candles, group candles together to give a great ambiance. Change the light bulbs. Okay, add finials to your lamps. Change the lampshades out. Add different plants. Change that plant holder. Group pictures. You know, make the pictures nice pictures that go in the nice picture frames. Dollar Tree has a ton of nice picture frames. I did a video on that also. Okay, that's it. That's all for a start on how to revamp for this coming spring. Love you all. Again, don't forget to subscribe. If you have any questions, cares, comments, or concerns, leave them in the box below. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. Excuse my speech. <clears throat> I don't know what's going on here, but love you all. Happy Valentine's Day. Bye-bye.